Good morning. We have Sophia in bed. What are you doing here? What are you doing? So this morning we are going to have breakfast and then we're going to go straight shopping. Yeah. Have you got anything to say, Sophia? Are you looking forward to go shopping? Yeah? I think she's had enough. <laughs> oh. Smart girl. When mummy teases you with... Oh, it's not so very... So yummy! Sophie is having Weetabix! Look, I don't mean to disparage on all the other dads, but I've got a mug that says best dad ever. Sorry, other dads out there. Alright, keep putting the knickers on. <laughs> Tried giving her some porridge, but she did not like it. She keeps spitting it out and making weird, funny faces. Porridge is a no-go for this girl. And we've got a little tooth coming through at the top, another one. We have reached our first destination. We are at Selby's aunt's farm. We are in her shop because it's quite hard to find eggs nowadays apparently and hoping we have some <gasps> she has some eggs they have all sorts of stuff they also sell meat that they raise hmm just an update on what shops we've been to. The first shop we went to was a Chinese store because I want to make army based stew. And then after that, we went to Aldi. No, yes, Aldi. There we got told that only one person per trolley. So me and Sophia went. And now we're in Lidl. And it is also one person per trolley, and Selby went instead. I kind of wish that we knew about it before we went out, because just last week it was one trolley per household, but apparently they changed it. But yeah, now I am stuck here in the car, just chilling, melting, got the AC on. Let you know when we get home. They're coming. Hi. Oh my gosh, my handsome husband knows me so well. Sophia has found her new favourite toy, sweet chilli sauce, a true Filipino. We're home and we're rushing lunch because we got back later than we wanted and Sophia was starving. So she'll eat and then go to sleep for a nap for about two hours and then we will play. The vlog. I'm so tired. <laughs> Can you guys put this away for me, please? Thanks. Love ya. Was it there? <laughs> Cheers, buds. 
One back down. More to go. So this is hmm, uh, probably about just over a week and a bit's worth of stuff. Uh, we've got a crying baby, so let's have another look. So this is kind of our meat for the week. A lot of beef mints this week because we're going to have meatloaf and meatballs in the same week. Chicken breast fillets, pork loin, pork belly, bacon, fish balls, prawns and sausages. Although I did get the wrong kind of. Now for the most satisfying bit which is bagging it all up and putting it in the freezer. Do you want to explain yourself, Sophia? That's what I thought. You're all meant to be sleeping. It's time to wake up, Sophia. Wakey, wakey. Sleepy head. Had her pacifier in because she wasn't settling. Snack time! I um, wonder what we'll get up to this afternoon before dinner. We'll see. We are going to make some Lumpiang Shanghai Filipino spring rolls. So in this bowl we have mince, onion, garlic, parsley and carrots. Salt and pepper as well. And then we have the spring roll wrap and water like a bird on a tree I'm just sitting here I got time, it's clear to see. We are done! There's definitely no way I would do this by myself. Dinner is served. So we've got lumpia, and then there's the kebab, and <coughs> some salad. We are now going to destroy this, aren't we, Sophia? Oh my goodness, you're looking a bit light on food there already. Damn. <laughs> Excuse me, you drink it. You drink it, Sophia, you drink it. Hey, that's not... That's not a cloth. You don't wipe under the table. You drink some water. <laughs> She's trolling me. When you Oh, oh. <laughs> pooping on camera. Quick, cut it. Sophia's all bathed and it's time for oh. me to freshen up because cooking um, Longbiang Shanghai needs a deep fat fryer so my hair stinks now so we will see you guys tomorrow bye bye